This is my freestanding do-it-yourself VR support rig and VR shoes. If the rig seemed a little louder and more unstable than previously, that's because I have a piece of square foam underneath of it, and it's a little small. And that's just propping this up, making it a little taller because I found that some of these corners would droop down and hit the floor. So that's just a temporary solution. I'm going to fix that soon. So what's going on back here is I have two pieces of conduit and two pipe crosses. These pieces of conduit go right through the crosses. This supports crouching, you can see. And then I have two uh, little bolts here to limit the crouching length. This is the crouching distance that I like personally, but obviously you could drill these at different spots for different crouching lengths. There is a constant force spring here that helps bring the whole thing back up when the user wants to stand back up. The whole thing is a little stiff and sliding doesn't really work very well. So. What I'm going to do is I'm going to replace these plastic pieces here, these two pla uh, black plastic pieces with more bearings and something that just slides better and that will create less friction. I also have a ratchet strap attached to this and that's just to make it so that this can't uh, play as much, it can't wiggle as much as it could without the ratchet strap. You may have noticed during the running demo that I hit my feet on this strap quite a few times. So what I'm planning on doing is routing this strap more like this so that it doesn't get in the way of my feet. This whole thing also supports leaning. So the whole thing can lean forward and back if the user wants. And how that works is I cut a few slits. You can see I cut a slit here that the bolt can ride along until it gets to the end of the slit. Then it stops the user from tilting anymore. So overall, I'm pretty happy with this rig. You saw all the features that it has. The one thing that I'm a little disappointed with is, and you may have noticed in the demo, that walking while turning is a little harder with this rig than with my ceiling mounted support rig. And I think that's because with this rig, there's just more mass to turn while you, while you turn. So there's more stuff that you have to turn than with the other rig. And I'm not sure what to do about that. I spent a lot of time making it smoother and it turns fine while walking. It's adequate. I think it's good enough. It's just not as good as with my other rig. That's it for this quick update. If you like the video, if you know what to do, see you next time.